All right, this morning we are talking with uh, John McLeish. Uh, John is with PIA Law. And, John, we're, we're talking about uh, boating and boating injuries. How significant is the risk of serious injury from boating? A very serious. Statistics show that approximately one-third of all water-related deaths in Canada arise from boating incidents and specifically uh, recreational activities, power boating, fishing, water skiing, that, that kind of thing. Uh, heaven forbid someone suffers a serious injury as a result of a boating accident. Uh, what are their rights? Well, they're similar to those of anyone else who's been seriously injured as, as a result of, of negligence. They can uh, advance a claim for their injuries and losses, such as if their injury is serious enough that their ability to earn a living has been affected, they can sue for that. Or if they're going to incur future care expenses they wouldn't otherwise incur, they can make a claim for that. A big problem with voting incidences is, unlike with automobile insurance, it is not mandatory that voters have insurance. So that is a big issue. Most do, some don't. So uh, the first order of business, really, if you've been injured, is to find out if the negligent uh, boater uh, did have an insurance policy either on the boat or something called an umbrella policy. And a lot of the, the cases that the firms of the PIA do is look for an insurance policy that would cover the negligent operator of, of the boat. Stay with us. We'll continue our discussion with John on boating and boat injuries and how you can protect yourself coming up. And we continue our discussion with John McLeish of PIA Law on boat injuries. Uh, John, what can people do to protect themselves? Well, there's some of the obvious things, uh, just to, to make sure they're safe on the water. There's rules and regulations for being in the water. They should always operate their boats at a safe speed, maintain control, of course, use uh, you know, light preservers, that kind of thing at, at, at all times, never to mix alcohol and, and, and boating, never, never do that. Just, you know, be aware of your surroundings and, and just be careful out there and those, those kinds of common sense type of things. All right. And, uh, of course, if folks want to get more information, they can drop by your website. Uh, yes, they can. That's, that's PIA Law and the three firms, Thompson Rogers, Oatley Vigman, and my firm, uh, McLeish Orlando, are referenced there. And the lawyers at PIA Law are very experienced indeed in, in in representing individuals who have been injured uh, as a result of of boating incidents. All right, so once again, that uh, website is PIALaw.ca, and we thank uh, John McLeish from PIA Law for joining us this morning. Thank you very much.